What's up guys? So uh, it is Thursday the 22nd and uh, they announced today that they found the Titan submarine or submersible uh, and that it had a sadly a catastrophic failure. Uh, I guess the bright side of that is that they weren't stuck in that tube for however many days, five days. Uh, and that there was no suffering, it was instantaneous. They probably really didn't even know that it was happening or happened. But, I mean, from what I gathered, it's, you know, something so freaking fast. Uh, but it's, it's pretty sad. Um, oh, can you guys see this wire in the way? Yeah, it's right in the way. It's from my speaker. Let me, uh, there we go. There we go. Uh, uh, so, uh, if you saw my short the other day when I first heard about the story, uh, I it was a couple days after, I think it was Tuesday, I believe. There, I'll look. Uh, I really didn't know. I hadn't heard about it until then. Uh, and I just thought, wow, this is a pretty wild story. Uh, but as the week went on, I really kind of got so wrapped around it um i think just because it's it was very interesting um but i wanted to just touch base and not that this is going to get to any of those people um uh, that are all these naysayers and just people talking crap uh but it's kind of frustrating to hear uh everyone saying well they, why would they go down there why would they do it? it's not safe blah 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 um, that's one of the issues that I, I'm having, and the other I'll get to, but, uh, why, why would they do that? Well, for exploration. I mean, well, why do people strap parachutes to their back and jump out of airplanes? Because it's fun and, and exciting, and, uh, and then you add exploration and science and, uh, engineering and all that to the you know that's what they're, they're we're into I, I don't see any problem with it um, the they knew what they were getting into they they read the waiver they signed it you know they know what they're doing I mean other than the 19 year old kid who said yeah I'll go with you dad kind of thing you know um, and maybe he talked to his dad they knew who, I don't I don't know but regardless they knew that it was dangerous and there's a good probability that it was going to not work very well or there's going to be problems. Of course you're always optimistic, you know, you're doing anything, but to, to talk crap about them doing that, uh, it's kind of ridiculous. Like, like I said, jumping out of airplanes or, I mean, how many people have died climbing Mount Everest, you know, like climbers say that they get up there and they find skeletal remains still, you know? So, and then like, think about how many people are so like fired up about SpaceX and Elon Musk. There's gonna be catastrophic failure. Actually, the, didn't the last rocket, I mean, it was, it was a success as far as they were concerned because it was a test, but it ended up failing and, you know, I mean, I think the freaking thing exploded. So there's gonna be those problems with anything with that extreme. It is what it is. You don't do it, and I don't do it, and I ain't jumping on an airplane either. So um, that was one of the things that was kind of bothering me when I was reading and, and videos. Again, like I said in my short, and I'll link it below, um, that I don't ever watch the mainstream news. I did catch a couple clips watching YouTube, uh, like of Fox and a couple CNN clips, just because they stood out, or whatever the headline was. Uh, but yeah, so there's that. The other thing uh, that was bothering me is people talking crap about the resources that we're using to go find these people that took this risk into their own hands and well that's ridiculous too. Uh, what does the Coast Guard do? That's what they do. Search and rescue and, and, and retrieve like you know drug smugglers and stuff. They, that's what they do every day. Some Yahoo gets a bonus at his, at his half a million dollar a year CEO job and goes and buys a sailboat and never been sailing in his life and takes his family out and the thing capsizes or whatever who comes? 
Coast Guard, the Navy. That's what, that's what those resources are there for. Just, <laughs> you know what I mean? It's no different. Yeah, this is a company, but there's companies that, like, think about these billionaires that have yachts and the yacht breaks down. Well, who has to go help? The Coast Guard or the Navy. So that argument is just kind of ridiculous to me. But what do you think? Do you, do you agree? Do you disagree? I mean, yeah, they took the risk and, and yeah, they're putting, you know, by doing what they did, I mean, people are doing it everywhere. There's, there's people diving in the Marianas Trench. What's going to happen if, if something happens there? They're going to send resources. It's, it's no different. Um, yeah, uh, the, what, what the CEO of the company, OceanGate, uh, they had clips of him saying, like, I break the rules and blah, blah. He, he's not saying, I think it was, like, kind of taken out of context. He's just saying, like, he's pushing the, the, the limits in, of engineering and, I get it. Well, he was anyway, right? Uh, that's what they're all doing. Everyone, everyone that's building something new that's never been done before is pushing those limits. So, yeah, there's obviously, uh, excuse me, things that he could have done differently, but you can say that about anything, right? So, anyway, uh, I just wanted to, like I said, make a short video and touch base on it because uh we got results today i guess and i'm sure we'll hear more about it in the d days and weeks to come uh, but it is sad for those those five men and their families and but you know what they 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 were doing something incredible do i want to go down and see the titanic no i'll google a picture of it if i really want to see it that bad i have seen it you've all seen it that's plenty for me I mean, we all know the end of the story. Jack froze to death, right? <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I don't know. I just, uh, like I said, I've been following it pretty closely all week ever since I saw, uh, saw the story and made that short video. Um, but I guess uh, we come to a conclusion that it failed and uh, those five men are no longer with us. So uh, their families will be in my prayers uh as they were all week really um yeah pretty sad but pretty extraordinary and uh yeah anyway thanks for watching guys later